hello guys welcome back to my channel today's video will be installing a wig from tenashi hair this is yet a thing by four lace front wig and it's in 180 density also this is in length 22 so this is the wig right out of the box this is what it looks like but i'm going to work on this wig before installing it this wig is everything i'm all, i love love the texture of this wig the wig is simply amazing it is very very easy to work with and you guys will love this so before i'm going to install this wig i will just pluck a little at the front part of this wig before installing this wig all the details of this wig will be in the description box as always so guys check my description box for more details about this hair and also do not forget to give this video a thumbs up if you find it helpful and if you have yet to subscribe to this channel what are you waiting for guys please hit that subscribe button and leave your comments in the comment section so what i'm going to do right now is just pluck a little section of the hair at the front of the hair before installing it now this process literally does not take time it actually just something i just want to pluck a little section of the hair before installing it now you can do without this process it's just what i want to do for this installation normally i don't do this in all of my installation but i just want to pluck a little section of the hair just experimenting new things and trying out new things to see what works best i'm going to be trying different things that i've seen other people doing on their wig on this wig today so you guys should just stay tuned, relax, and enjoy this video. Get so complicated, you lose. Your mind I'm just a change it. And tomorrow you'll regret it. But until the morning. Dance with me, baby. You take away the pain. Dance with me, baby. So after plucking the front, this is what it looks like. I don't know if you guys can see the difference between what it was before and what it is now definitely there's a big difference between what it was before and what it is now so this is what it looks like right now as against what it was before definitely there's a difference in the boat i'm going to apply my powder on it just to make it blend very well with my skin because if i don't do that it will be like it will be too off and different from my skin and i want this to look as natural as possible so i'm going to apply my powder on it before i'm going to wear this wig now for the installation of this wig i'm just going to use my got to be glue to install this wig now this is what i use in all other of my installation as in if you guys have been following me on this channel you know that this is what i use the got to be glue is what i use it is pretty much very easy for me to use in installing my wig I find it very easy to use and it works perfectly well for me so guys this is how the hair blends with my skin you guys can see the blend like it looks so so natural it looks so much like my hair you guys see it looks so much like my hair like you cannot detect or tell where the lace you cannot detect or tell where the lace is on my head right now you guys see how it blends so i'm going to cut off the lace net before i apply the got to be glue on the wig so complicated you lose your mind i'm just a change it and tomorrow you'll regret it but until the morning dance with me baby you take away the pain dance with me baby you can lead the way dance with me baby 
after applying the got to be glue i'm going to use my hand dryer to blue dry it just so it dries and stick very well to my hair and you guys see how this blends with my skin you guys see it it blends perfectly well with my skin and it feels like or it looks like it's my natural hair <laughs> it just blends so well guys this i'm loving this hair i'm loving this wig i love the fact that i was able to pluck it a little bit you guys because i'm seeing the difference i love the fact that i was able to pluck it a little bit you guys see the effect of the powder i added to the lace front before installing it before wearing it it made a lot of difference and it makes this blend very well with my skin now i'm going for a center part look so i'm going to use my comb and then pat the hair and then use my wash stick to kind of lay it down make it flat and i'm just going to use it to apply on both sides of the wig then go ahead to do the baby hair So this is everything I did and this is the final look of this wig. Hope you guys enjoyed this installation. Please do not forget to leave your comment in the comment section and please check my description box for further details about this wig. Until next time, I love you guys. Bye bye.